Hello everybody. Welcome to another edition of Inside the Lab. It's a special day. Because today, we're going to be talking about some of these crystals and stones that's inside the lab. Now I'm going to talk about what we got inside the lab. Show off some of our work. Talk about the metaphysical properties of the crystals and stones of today. And we're finally going to tell you how you can get your hands on some of this material. Yes. Showing off that grid work. Let me steady this camera up real quick for y'all. So y'all look at that beautifulness. Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? So today we're going to begin by talking about quartz. Quartz crystal is known as the most powerful in the mineral kingdom because it has many uses, such as manifestation, the aids in healing, meditation, channeling, protection, and increasing the vibration of other things. It's an amplifier, so to speak. Crystal quartz has like six primary functions, and that's like structure, storing, amplifying, focus, transmitting, and transforming energies. Some of these energies include thoughts, emotion, and information. They also are known as like tuning the force for your chakras too. They can amplify those as well, you know. Structural, transform, or transmute. Help you uh, focus those energies on your chakras. Uh, Quartz can also harmonize the energies of the environment. Yes, we are for you to harmonize the game. Right. <laughs> Wisdom and clarification is promoted by Quartz, aiding in spiritual advancement. It improves or enhances creativity, inspiration, concentration, retaining what is learned, physical and mental states. It balances out the stamina and increases it and your physical strength. Now, you ain't got no cords in your collection. It's time for you to go get some. But as you can see, quartz crystal gives <laughs> you a lot. And there are many different types of quartz crystals. Many. And we're going to talk about some of them today. Uh, I'm going to talk about this root beer quartz. Root beer quartz? Yeah, y'all. I said it. Root beer quartz. Actually, it's a calcite. It's called root beer calcite. Let me make sure I get a, a close look at that. Yeah. Group your cows, and that's a beauty, ain't it? Let y'all look at that. Once again, this is group your cow side. Especially those of toxic repetition. It provides equilibrium. It helps with better decision making. It aids in maintaining balance, especially at home and work. And it extremely works well with your lower chakras. Aligning the chakras. What chakras am I talking about? That's your sacral chakra, your solar plexus, and your root chakra. You may to in understanding the chakras, you can go look them up or don't worry, future video coming, we'll talk more about chakras. Yes, we will. All right, but back to root beer calcite. It protects you from negative energy, it aids in creating peace, it's 
also a prosperity stone. So I suggest using that with your um, citrine to um, increase the ability or powers. So prosperity can go stone through that. You got stones that have similar to similar characteristics you want to put them together and uh, put your attention into that. So in this case, you would be putting your attention into uh, prosperity coming into your life. So, you know, got your root beer cow sign and you got your uh, citrine. You go ahead and throw some cords up in there. Cause remember, it's an amplifier. It's going to increase those energies and focus those energies. And that's what you want. So you put those three together and then five things are going to you have it. Did I talk too fast for y'all? I'm sorry. But anyway, it heightens mental discernment and analysis, increases memory and learning abilities. It aids in reaching agreements when in debates. It can also calm down uh, arguments, even those that you're not in. You can post those energies to um, do that. Uh, it aids in the absorption of calcium. It balances the metabolism and enhances vitality. It connects well with Scorpio and Pisces houses. Yeah, and that's new real kind of I do know that these are just some general uh, abilities and characteristics of root beer calcite. There's much more to it. Feel free to go look it up and see more of what it does and what it can do for you. Yay, yay. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Much love. Boom. I know y'all like, oh my goodness. Is that like ice? Y'all close. Y'all close. Y'all close. And then particularly ice, you know what I'm saying? But it is known as fire and ice quartz. Yes. It's also known as rainbow quartz or crackle quartz. The reason why they call it rainbow quartz is because when you do hit it in the right light, which I'm not being capable of doing that on the camera here for y'all. When y'all hit it in the right light, it shows rainbows inside of the quartz. And that's all due to the fractures that's on the inside of it. And that's how you know when you got um, rainbow quartz because of the fractures in it. Glosses off with rainbows. Now, there's some beautiful pieces, right? Yes. Yes. And these are for some of y'all. Some of y'all about to get some of these. But right now, I, I want to talk to y'all about this fire and ice quartz. It is great for every chakra, y'all. I'm just gonna be real. It opens up all chakras. Rainbow quartz is a highly, highly, extremely, I don't know how, how else to put it, y'all. It is rare. This is a rare quartz to you get your hands on. Okay, and when you can't find some, please be aware that some people heat treat it and you can tell when it's heat treated because it has a metallic look with a beautiful rainbow sheen to it. And yeah, that's come from them heat treating it and mixing it up with metals and everything, which is beautiful and everything. But if you're looking for a real fire and ice quartz, you want to make sure that you look out for that because that's not fire and ice quartz. It's another type of quartz that they done made up, which I'm not taking away from its energies or any of that, I'm just saying, if you look for fire and ice, of course, do be careful for that. But, other than that warning, fire and ice, course, ties the physical body to the earth star chakra, which in turn, which then helps you to connect with the spiritual realm. It opens a pathway to the higher understanding. It aids in the ability to remember one's soul purpose. It is a high vibrational stone, a purification stone. It raises your vibration toward um, blocking or warding off unwanted energies and negative vibrations. 
now when you can combine this with some clear work like it Miss Grid that you see before you um, it definitely helps clear your area it helps raise the vibration of the area as well as yourself uh, it resonates well with the tree of life so however you can incorporate the tree of life with this you know Great. That's to the alchemists out there, hint, hint, you know, just gave all uh, a little something to work with. But anyway, yes, uh, fire and ice quartz resonates with the tree of life. Yeah, I said that already. It aids in accessing information from higher dimensions. Healers, 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 healers. Please use this stone to balance light and connect with archangels like Raphael because uh, he's a healing angel if you're into connecting with angels and all that there's a little information for you hint hint oh you know what I didn't even notice y'all we can see a little rainbow off of this one right here with the way that that light shining yeah I know y'all like that I'm going to show y'all something real quick some of the stuff I'm working on. Yes. You see. Some beautiful amethyst, y'all. Let me tell you. Wrapping this amethyst was not easy. I had to learn a new way of wrapping, y'all. And it is difficult. Especially because of the way that these things are shaped. They're all oblong. But Master Flame didn't become a master by not accepting challenges. You know what I mean? I accept challenges. Bring on your greatest dragon. We got a sword big enough for that. Nah, I just play it. I just play it. We don't kill dragons, y'all. We like dragons. Yes. Master Flame did another round of arrowheads. I'm almost done with them. This ain't all of them. Yeah, a hundred in total. Yes, a hundred of those uh, amethysts too. Now the amethyst is not for uh, sale right now. But uh, if you would like to purchase one of these arrowheads on a necklace, on a cotton necklace, uh, you can contact me through Facebook, my Twin Flame Treasures page. Just shoot me a message. I want an arrowhead because I don't keep those around here. They come in and they go. So when they come in, if y'all want some, because you've seen it on this show, hit me up. And if I got them in, yeah, they're all yours. All right. So I talked about some of the course that I wanted to talk about today, y'all. Showed off some of my raps, some of my work. I want y'all, ha ha ha, yeah, I'm about to get y'all right here. I want y'all to tune in to my pick or die uh, reading. And stay tuned to the end. And I will tell you exactly how you can purchase some of this material. Uh, I'm going to let y'all know, for real, it was not easy me finding a place for me to be able to sell y'all this material and it's all due to the fact of promise which is um one of the universal laws the law of promise y'all know i'm always talking about the universal laws we always gonna be talking about those y'all gonna know all of them by the time i'm i'm done with you anyway i promised these crystals and stones when they came here to crystal kingdom that any of those that did not want to stay with me I will aid in helping them to get to their owners. What we're doing so, I also made sure that I let them know that I'm not just going to let anybody buy them. They want to be used, y'all. They want to be adorned. They don't want to be in somebody's closet. They don't want to be sitting around collecting dust. They want to be held. They want to be looked at. They want to be talked about. They want to use their abilities and powers on you. 
They want to take some of your energies, like little vampires. How's it, Flair? No, I'm not. They do take your energies, though. They're not vampires, though. Because they get back to you. So, when it came down to me trying to get y'all a shop, I have had multiple failed missions. I'm talking about some rare stuff. And it wasn't until today that I realized what was going on, why I was continuing to experience such a thing. Now that I understand why, that's where we're going to move on to the fact of I done made it where only y'all can get them. I'm going to tell you how you can get them in the next show. We don't want um, people buying y'all stuff just because it's pretty. We don't want people buying y'all stuff because, oh, that is an extremely nice specimen. No, we don't want that. We want y'all to get this stuff because I know that you all are going to use these materials for what they are meant for. I know you all are going to adore them. I know you all are going to love them and show them that unconditional love that's necessary. And they're going to do it right back at you. So, stay tuned into the Pick a Die reading. We're going to tell you how to get these. And other things that's going to be so through that particular store just for y'all. Because only y'all going to have access to that. Yeah. So until next time, y'all. Peace, love, prosperity, abundance, and everything that you truly want and your truly hearts desire come to you. And may it come to you in full force. Oh, I do want to point this out, y'all. That right there is a very special piece of rainbow quartz. That piece of rainbow quartz is combined with citrine. And as you've been watching this video, I've been making sure that I kept it on the screen. And I've been sending y'all prosperity energies, abundance. Yes, I've been sending it to you. That's what that grid is programmed for. That part of the grid is programmed just for y'all. The music that you hear playing in the background, also dedicated to y'all, is to attract more love into your life, to increase your love powers, and to attract prosperity and abundance into your life, and to increase your thankfulness for what you do have. Because the more that you are grateful for the things that you do have, the more things that you are going to attract to you. It shows the multiverse that you are highly appreciative and the multiverse is going to shower you with even more. And that is law. It's the law of gratification. Like I said, y'all going to know all the laws by the time y'all know me. All right, y'all. We'll see y'all next time. Y'all, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I made a promise to some of y'all and I almost forgot that. I told y'all that I was going to tell y'all about the power of amethyst. And I almost forgot. No worries, no worries. That's why I take notes. <laughs> Let's see, the power of amethyst. It means not intoxicated. It relieves stress, strain, relief, and tension. It soothes irritability, balances mood swings, dispels anger, rage, fear, and anxiety. It activates spiritual awareness, prevention of drunkenness by removing toxins from the drinks, which aids in soberness. It prevents overindulgence. It aids in psychic protection and security. And it represents royalty. Yay, yay. Get you some amethyst, my kings and queens. Yay. It helps protect one from evil thoughts. It helps overall control of one's thoughts and aids in mindfulness. It removes guilty and fearful feelings. It protects against witchcraft. 
it helps with cleansing the environment. So you know to use that with your rainbow quartz. Amethyst and rainbow quartz and clear quartz. Those three together, we're talking about a very positive environment. Yes, we are. Uh, let's see. It ensures peaceful sleep and it keeps nightmares away. It helps with remembering dreams and understanding them. It brings about hormonal balances. I uh, probably shouldn't have said that. I don't want nobody feeling no type of way. <laughs> I was just playing, y'all. I was just playing. All right, it boosts the immune system, purifies the blood, reducing physical, emotional, and psychological pain and stress. It's useful for people suffering from dis-ease of the lungs and respiratory tract, skin conditions, and disorders dis-ease notice I said dis-ease not comfortable not that other word that they be used but anyway it helps with disorders in cells and dis-ease of the digestive system and this stone is associated with the house of Aquarius that don't mean that we all can't use the stone it's just the Aquarians are more tuned in to the powers of amethyst but we all can be blessed with the mighty powers of amethyst yes so make sure you get you some i'm gonna show y'all some of mine real quick you know what i'm saying because we got it in the grill work if i'm gonna tell you you put it in there I, you darn right i'm gonna have me some there, there it is right there y'all i see it and look it got a little citrine in there gray combination of clear quartz citrine and the amethyst you talking about a powerful space cleanser right there y'all i can't lift it up right now because it's doing this job but that's that uh root beer calcite y'all all the little specks that you see all of it it's little tiny clusters of quartz crystal all over that i'm talking about it look like a cinnamon snack right now y'all i want to eat it I'm, I'm gonna turn this off and I'm about to go have me a snack because that piece is making me home. All right, y'all, but I ain't gonna overindulge. You know what I'm saying? If that's what Amethyst Bowl helped prevent me from overindulging, I'm gonna have me a quick snack. Then I'm gonna cleanse the area. Ha <laughs> ha, it's already cleared. Ah, yeah, yeah. But I'm about to get ready for uh, this pick a die reading. I'll see y'all later. Unconditional love. Love light always, y'all.